Okay, this is a short video of my latest purchase, which is the Sky Industries model CPX2T. And you can see, do not use this pistol until you have read all the enclosed instructions and have been instructed in safe gun handling by a competent firearms instructor. And also, this firearm is supplied with a child resistant lock and extra magazine made in the USA. Now, if I'm if I remember correctly, Sky Industries is sort of an offshoot of Caltech. I believe some of their former employees struck out on their own and decided to go into the manufacturing business themselves. So let's just take a quick look inside and we have the instruction manual. We have a warranty information card. The enclosed uh, or the uh, spent casing for the uh, the test. Two magazine butt plates. Spare magazine. Small tube of gun lubricant. Pro Gold Manufacturing. Never actually used this. Two spare keys. And the pistol itself. So this is the very first time that I'm actually even unlocking this. I just picked it up yesterday. And yesterday was June the 29th, 2012. So this is a, first of all, this is a kind of a nice lock. It's uh, spring-loaded. So it snaps right back in place, and I don't think I've ever seen a spring-loaded uh, trigger lock before. Usually they're like um, two pieces, or the ones I've seen are two pieces, and they dis uh, disassemble, and then you close them back together around the, uh, the actual trigger guard and trigger. So this is it. And I was interested in actually purchasing something that may serve as a concealed carry uh, pistol. Perhaps to give me more firepower than my small Taurus uh, 380. Of course, that depends on how things work out with the, uh, the testing and the uh, trial carries and all that. You see, it has a three dot sight. And one thing that I always like about a pistol is when it does have the uh, lockback feature. Some small pistols do not have a lockback feature on it. You have free drop. Uh, Magazine release. Hand grip is uh, sculptured for your finger grooves or finger grooves right here, so you can get a nice grip on that. I'm indifferent to that. It doesn't matter if it has it. it doesn't matter if it doesn't. But in any case, this was just a uh, short video showing my new Sky Industries CPX-2T 9mm. So, as I said, I haven't even, this is the first time I've actually even taken it out of the box. So, 
Uh, like I said, I just wanted to do a quick video on this. Um, let me know what you guys think about Sky Industries. I know they had some issues very early on with some of their products. Um, I think the reviews lately have been much more favorable and so that's one of the reasons why I decided to uh, take a chance on them and see exactly what their products about and see how it holds up it's not a very expensive uh, pistol I got it through gallery for guns cost all told just a little over three hundred dollars so in the grand scheme of things that's not gonna make me it's not gonna break me so um, I just went ahead and made the purchase all right, thanks for watching, and I'll probably do a later one with a little more details on it, uh, perhaps a uh, range test or post-range test uh, video on this, and let you know what I've thought about it and how it performed. Okay, thanks for watching. Once again, bye-bye.